James Lennis, I'm totally loving Grenache, uh, as I've always loved Grenache, and especially this one here. This is from the Rogue Valley in Oregon. It's from Tune Vineyard, so stay tuned for this review. So, uh, True and Vineyard, this is a beautiful wine, Grenache 2016 Vintage, Rogue Valley. And uh, so back label, this is 100% Grenache. For, so this is native ferment, 14.8% ABV, 100% Grenache, and it's coming from Southern Oregon. And uh, when I saw it, it said 14.8% ABV, and not that that's a bad thing, I'm judging now. It's more like 14.8% from Oregon. And um, I guess based on my little hamlet of San Francisco, I forget that it does get hot in other places. Uh, it's a beautiful wine, very, very lustrous in terms of its coloration. My favorite term is cathedral stained glass window, and it really exemplifies that. Now, I love that I've been tasting uh, Grenache or Garanacha from Northeast Spain and Southern France, and those are characterizing very, very differently. And, um, you know, I, I definitely get the, you know, I could do a blind tasting of Grenache. I could tell you basically new world versus old world. I may not necessarily be able to tell you this is from Oregon or this is from California or this is from Australia or uh, France or, or Sardinia or Spain or so forth. I think for me, this is a really handsome, exemplified, uh, identifiable Grenache. So 93 points out of 100 points. So getting a characteristic of heirloom blackberry, which I don't often use in a Grenache example, but in this, uh, particular scent profile is definitely identifiable as such. Red cherry, uh, sweet scent of suede, say that three times. Um, crushed red candy and a bit of violet notes. Very nice. Next, the flavor profile. And the flavor characterization is really outstanding. Now, on the characterization, you're getting notes of red cherry, so those tart notes. Tart notes for me signify Grenache is really exemplary as well as pomegranate. And again, a tart note, thyme, tarragon, white pepper, crushed red candy and a bit of violet notes. So all these come together and sing a beautiful uh, song of Grenache. And I can't say enough about Grenache. And I love this producer. I love what they're doing. And I think they're doing some exemplary wines from Southern Oregon. So thank you for watching. I'll put more information on the producer down below. Questions and comments can be listed there as well. And guess what's down below? The like button. So please hit that button if you haven't done so already. And uh, right up here is the subscribe button. So please hit that button if you haven't already. And the purpose of the subscribe button is really to look at my latest videos. Um, we can also have a conversation on the many social medias that I'm on that you might be on as well, such as Facebook, Twitter, I'm on Instagram, LinkedIn, as well as WordPress. Many more fantastic wines to come. So thank you so much for watching today. Let's stay connected. Sante.